أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم My dear brothers and sisters in Islam Once again, Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi ta'ala wa barakatuh May peace and blessings be upon our beloved Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam His family and companions This is episode 3 of the Islamic modes of finance for individuals in the first and second episodes or series, we talk about two of the non-participatory mode of finance used by Islamic banks, namely cost plus profit transactions, al murabaha and lease to own contract, al ijara al muntahiya bit tamlik. Both are available on this blessed channel, inshallah ta'ala, for your reference today we will talk on a participatory mode of finance used by islamic banks as well which is diminishing musharaka diminishing partnership al musharaka al mutanaqisa as i always say our focus and, and objective is to explain the basic concept of Islamic banking system, the basic concept of Islamic mode of finance, so that our brothers and sisters across the globe, all over the world, can comprehend and understand the basic principles of Islamic banking system. So what is Musharaka? Musharaka simply refer to a partnership simply refer to a partnership in a joint enterprise in a joint project in a joint venture in which all the partners share the profits or losses if any in the venture in the project in the enterprise so musharaka simply refers to a, a partnership in a joint project where all the partners share profits or losses if any in the project what is diminishing musharaka my brother my sister in islam diminishing musharaka al musharaka al mutanaqisa is a form of joint partnership to buy an asset like car, like house, in which one of the partners promises to buy the equity share of the other party gradually and systematically until the title of the uh, equity is completely transferred to him. So, Musharaka al Mutanaqisa, diminishing Musharaka, is a form of partnership to buy an asset, as I said, like car or house, in which one of the partners promises the other party to, purch to purchase his share in the assets until the title, until the, uh, the title to the equi equity. Is completely transferred to him. So this is Musharaka al Mutanaqisa. With example, the concept will be clearer. Suppose you want to buy a house, but you do not have enough money. You don't know. You do not have enough fund to purchase that house. Then you go to Islamic Bank. You approach Islamic Bank, which agrees to participate in purchasing that house, in buying that house. Let's say the house price is $100,000 and you have only $20,000. So the Islamic bank will pay or will put $80,000, which is 80% of the house price, and you will pay or you put $20,000, which is the 20% the, the 
of the house price. After purchasing the house together, you as a client, you will use that house as your residential and you will pay the rent to the Islamic bank for using its share in that house. So after purchasing the house, buying the house together, you and Islamic bank, you will use that house or the car or etc. as your residential. And then you will pay the rent to Islamic bank for its share in that house. At the same time, the share of the Islamic bank will be divided into equal units. The more you purchase the Islamic bank, bank's share, the more your share as client in the house increase and the share of Islamic bank reduce or decrease. As we said, you put $20,000 initially and the Islamic bank put 80% uh, and then you promise to purchase Islamic bank, Islamic bank's share, this 80% gradually and systematically. Let's say this month, you purchase 10% of Islamic share, 10 units. So your share in, in, the, in the house price will increase to 30% before you have 20% now will increase to 30%. And the Islamic bank's share will decrease, will reduce to 20, uh, to 70%. So this function will continue. This will continue until the end of the contract, uh, until the share of the Islamic bank become zero and your share in the house price or in the asset become 100%. Then you will own the, the asset, you will own the house. But remember, the more you pay the, the, the more you purchase the share of Islamic bank, the rent also will be re reduced to that, to the extent of the, of the share that you purchase. So the more you pay the rent or the more you purchase the Islamic bank share, the rent also will reduce to that, will reduce to that extent. So once again, you wanna buy a house, you want to buy a car you don't have enough money you go to islamic bank which agrees to participate in buying their house or in buying the car so the islamic bank let's say the house is hundred thousand dollars as we said islamic bank pay eighty thousand dollars and you pay twenty thousand dollars so the islamic banks share in their house is eighty percent and yours is twenty percent and you promise to purchase the house, to purchase the Islamic bank's share gradually and systematically. So whenever you purchase the Islamic uh, bank's share, your share in the house price increase and the share of Islamic banks, uh, of Islamic bank reduce. So every month you promise to purchase Islamic bank's share every month. So this month you purchase one unit which represent, uh, we say 10% from the house price. In that case, your share in the, in the house price will increase to 30% and the Islamic bank's share will reduce to 70%. And this will continue until the end of the contract. Eventually, you will own the house. The more you pay, the, you, you purchase the share, the more the rental also reduced to that extent, it means to the extent of the share that you purchase. My brother, my sister in Islam, diminishing musharaka, I hope that the concept now is clear about diminishing musharaka. My brother, my sister in Islam, diminishing musharaka has some Sharia rules or many rules, but we will mention only a uh, few. 
number one separate of the contract because musharaka dimension musharaka also involved buying and selling at the end of the contract as we mentioned in the ijara contract so we have to separate the two contracts we cannot include in the musharaka contract the buying and selling buying and selling should be totally separate number two um the, you as client and the islamic bank must bear the cost of uh, let's say insurance or the house maintenance right so both of you must we cannot put in the musharaka contract that only one party one partner will bear the cost of insurance or maintenance of the house this is not acceptable from sharia perspective both of you should bear the the the, the should bear should bear the cost of insurance and the maintenance of the house or of the car inshallah three uh, as we mentioned both of you should contribute a specific amount in the transaction you have to bring some money and islamic bank has to bring some money if there is any loss both of you also should share it if there is any law uh, loss each one of you should share in the loss and the profit as well there are many rules and regulations but we will mention only the these three due to time constraint so to conclude my brother and sister in islam the general rules of musharaka contract should apply in the diminishing musharaka as well especially the sharikat uh, al-inan sharikat al-inan rules and principles here sharikat al-inan my brother my sister is a contractual uh, partnership or capital partnership whereby uh, both of partners contribute a specific amount in a project as partners so sharikat al-inan rules in general the rules of uh, musharaka contract should apply in diminishing musharaka as well especially the uh, sharikat al-inan sharikat al-inan as i said is a capital uh, partnership or contractual partnership whereby uh, both parties will contribute a specific a specific amount in the project as partners why we said the why sharia say the rules of partnership and should be you know applied here also in order to af avoid uh, this type of uh, partnership uh, from becoming uh, just only uh, interest uh, based finance transactions to avoid you know this type of transaction the mission musharaka becoming like kind of uh, interest based transactions you just uh, uh, let's say client just only undertake to pay another party for his what you call for his finance in addition to a share in the partnership uh, income so the rules of the rules of uh, the rules of partnership should apply especially shirkat al inan in order to avoid this transaction being a mere uh, interest based financing finally my dear brothers and sisters in islam is there any difference between musharaka al mutanaqisa diminishing musharaka and lease to own al ijara al muntahiya bi tamlik the answer is yes musharaka al mutanaqisa is based on partnership as we said islamic bank put some money and you put some money so it's based on partnership both of you you know own the asset own the uh, the, the, the 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 project so uh diminishing musharaka is based on partnership it's based on partnership if there's any loss both of you will bear it also uh in the diminishing musharaka as we mentioned the concept is that the client will keep on purchasing or buying the stick or the uh, the stick of the of the islamic bank uh bank share right until eventually on the house so the concept of the mission musharaka is totally different from the least own even though both will be uh the client will be you know 
uh, owning the house at the end of the contract. So the basic diminishing Musharaka is based on partnership where um, whereby the uh, Ijara al Montehia Bitamlik is based on lease uh, on lease contract of the asset owned by the Islamic Bank. As we mentioned in the Al Ijara Al Montehia Bitamlik that the, uh, the bank has to own the house first before he leaves it to you, before the bank leaves it to you. So uh, one of the main difference here, you and in the Munition Musharaka, you and the bank purchase the house together. Here the bank has to own the house first and then lease it to you. Even though both, eventually you will own uh, the house. So to make it simple, the Munition Musharaka is based on partnership in buying the asset and uh, lease to own is based on lease you know arrangements lease arrangement you know property owned by the bank and lease it to you so i hope all now is clear inshallah the concept of the mission musharaka and until we meet you know again inshallah in the episode episode uh, four I pray that Allah Taala is all your affairs and uh, provide you with lawful and halal provisions. Barakallahu fiikum wa saddada khutaakum wa hafidakum min kulli makruh wa hafidakum min kulli makruh wa hafidakum min kulli makruh Hada wa sallallahu ala sayyidina muhammadin wa ala alihi wa sahbihi wa sallam tasliman kathira wa alhamdulillahi rabbil alameen بارك الله فيكم هذا وصلى الله على سيدنا محمد والسلام عليكم ورحمة الله تعالى وبركاته